We'll check back in with you. All right, 546 now. Let's turn to our full forecast with meteorologist Tammy Sousa. She has been tracking it all for us. It is not done with us. Oh, just yet. No, not it's close. not. We're already getting totals that are more than a foot coming out of parts of uh, the Jersey Shore. So uh, it is going to be a messy day, and we're still going for a while here. You know what? We're going to check in with our eyewitness weather watchers. This isn't uh, kind of like one of those fun, haha, what are we doing today? No, they are our spotters, our eyes and our ears around the area. Let's go right over here. Let's first go to South Jersey. This is Jim Brown. Jim has eight inches of snowfall right now in Franklinville, New Jersey. 25 degrees there, and the snow is still coming. Coming down in that area. Let's check out what's going on here in Newark. It is uh, 24 degrees at Walter Brule's house in Newark, 2.25 inches of snow. He's got a picture here. So, this is something that you can do. You can become one of our weather watchers, send us pictures, send us the information. There you go. So, not quite three inches, but it's going to keep falling. You're going to end up with four plus inches there in, uh, in Newark. So, that's something that we'll keep an eye on. Uh, so, let's take a look at what's going on right now. I have this picture from down in Cape May. Look at this. This is a live shot in Cape May, and uh, you can see easily that that is a good eight to ten inches of snow that is sitting out here on top of all of this. And so this is live; it is still coming down. We are still looking at a mess out there. The visibility, because of this heavy snow and because of it blowing and drifting, has really diminished across the entire area, but especially down the shore. Three tenths of a mile in Wildwood, half a mile in Atlantic City. Then we get up to Trenton, where it's eight tenths of a mile, about one and a third. Miles here in Philadelphia, so not as bad as some of the other areas, but everybody is seeing much lower visibility, and especially down the shore where we are seeing at times whiteout conditions, meaning zero visibility. You really won't be able to see more than a few feet in front of you. Now, what's going on? We've got these winds coming in out of the north, and they are gusting already. I mean, this is not the wind gust, this is the wind speed. So, this is a consistent wind speed 24 mile an hour wind speed in Atlantic City, 20 in Philadelphia. The gusts are higher than that. We're going to see these gusts really picking up to anywhere from 40 mile an hour gusts in Philadelphia down the shore to be 50 to 60 mile an hour wind gusts. So, here is the storm right now on Storm Scan 3, and you can see the darker shades of purple running down the shore here, lighter shades across Philadelphia, and just really very light snow falling up into the Lehigh Valley. I want to share with you some of these reports. We're already getting some of these snow reports. In across the area. We're going to be flooded with these uh, not too long from now, but right now we're looking at 10 inches reported as of 515 this morning in Cape May. That is the snow accumulation that came out of the report at the tip of Cape May. Let's go to, uh, let's see, Forked River. Up, up here we're looking at 12 and a half, I mean 12, we're looking at a foot. Of snow up there. I'm looking at that and I'm going, wow, 12 and a half inches of snow up there. That is a lot of snow. And that came in at 510 this morning. And finally, we're looking here in Atlantic County. We are looking at 11.4 inches of snow. And that's at Port Republic. So we are definitely seeing that heavy snow come down. And it's going to still come down. That's why we're thinking, yes, that 15 inch mark is going to be about right, especially a little bit away from the shore. But along the shore, to see 18 inches or more than 18 inches in some spots, that is absolutely. Going to happen. So here we go with Storm Scan 3. The darker shades of purple from Cape May through North Wildwood. Not so much in Dennis, but you're still getting a steady snow there, but the heavier snow hanging right along the shore. Atlantic City, uh, Brigantine, Ocean City, Egg Harbor, you're getting a steady snow, not the heaviest snow like they're getting at the shore up to Little Egg Harbor, Toms River, and Forked River. That is where we are seeing this very dark shade of purple, and that's where we're really seeing that snowfall at two to three inches an hour. In Philadelphia, just a light snow that is falling. And It'll continue to fall. The system is really kind of cutting off along that I-95 corridor. It's a very sharp cutoff, so the heavier snow is going to be across South Jersey and the shore. Nonetheless, that four to eight inches plus in Philadelphia is going to be very real already. A lot of that on the ground. If you step outside, you'll see it. In northern uh, Delaware and over into uh, say Salem County in South Jersey, again, lighter snow falling there and very light snowfall taking place in the Lehigh Valley up into the Poconos right now. The the entire system is very slowly lifting up the coastline. At the bottom of your screen here is where the center of this system is, so it's still lifting northward. It's just the right distance offshore to produce these incredible amounts of snow across the shore and into South Jersey and even into Philadelphia. I mean, four to eight inches of snow, perhaps isolated amounts higher. That's not too shabby. Up to 18 inches of snow in some spots down the shore. We're going to see the whiteout conditions. Here we go. We're going to put this into a future cast mode. Seven o'clock, eight o'clock. Here we go. We roll 
through 8 o'clock, still looking at very steady to heavy snow. 10 o'clock, it starts to let up. So you're going to start to see a light to moderate snow. And we're going to start to see the winds pick up. By the time we get into noon, things are really starting to taper off. We get into 3 o'clock, and we really should be looking at maybe just a light snow shower, if anything at all. The same thing, we're going to be looking at that in South Jersey. These are the places that will be hardest hit. 8 to 12 inches of heavy snow. We will be seeing dangerous road travel. I got to tell you that, that's not going to let up. Scattered power outages as we head through 10, 11 o'clock. The winds pick up. Here we are at about 11 noon. Things start to taper off, and that's when you'll be able to go out and really do that cleanup out there. But again, stay off of the roads everywhere right now. And you know that if you're watching us, you're smart, you're staying at home.